Coronavirus vaccination efforts continue statewide. One of the local hospitals putting shots in arms, St. Clair. As Dr. Maria Simbro reports, the hospital is doing the best it can with the limited supply. St. Clair Hospital is vaccinating some people in the top priority group, Group 1A. We you know, reached out to some of our um, established patients in the age ranges that we thought were um, at highest risk. As you compared relative risks, um, the overwhelming one was age. To target those most likely to be hospitalized or die from COVID-19, St. Clair Hospital is only vaccinating patients in their database 75 years old and up. Supplies are limited. Whether we're getting one to 2,000 doses per week, um, we're going to try to do 2,000 this week based on you know, what we have. For that reason, the hospital is only immunizing a subset of this broad group that includes people 65 and up and people with cancer, obesity, COPD, and other chronic health conditions. Going with an age-based strategy has mostly been non-negotiable. People outside of the strict parameters still try to get in. You want to create context for them that there are people that are at much higher risk for them. I tell people to keep their eye on several um, potential supply routes, but that pharmacies have struck me as um, uh, potentially an easier route for some people who are anxious to, to get um, their dose today. The people coming to the hospital are full of joy. Dr. Sullivan likens it to the birth of a baby. I find myself congratulating, you know, the World War II veteran and his walker. Um, people are taking pictures with their parents. Doing this in the middle of winter has additional challenges. We had some cancellations yesterday, so all of us have plans in place to not waste any vaccine. We can't waste a single dose of vaccine given its um, value. If you have to cancel your second dose because of weather, don't worry. It doesn't have to be exactly 21 or 28 days, depending on whether you get Pfizer or Moderna. The CDC says you have up to 42 days. I'm Dr. Maria Simra, KDKA News.